and welcome back to the Tableau Jedi channel. Today I want to talk about how to make a top end and bottom end parameter. We're going to do this by creating a packed bubble chart. So let's go ahead and jump in. Let's go ahead and pick a dimension. Let's pick salesperson. Let's grab a measure. We'll do total compensation. Drag that to the rows. You can come over here to the show me. This is native to Tableau, so that'll do the rest for you there. Now what you have to do is you have to go back over to the same measure and drag that to color. And see, there you go. Now, the darker the color, the higher the number here. There's going to be times where your customer, your boss, they want just a static top five, top ten. That's all they want to see. But they also are going to have times where they want to be in control themselves and they want to see the top three, five, ten, fifteen, and, and back and forth. So here's what you do. Okay. Let's go ahead and create the first parameter. Go up here, right click, create parameter. Let's name this top in. This is going to be an integer. Okay. Don't worry about that. Allowable values, you can put all. I want a range. I tend to do that because a lot of times with some dimensions, there's a lot of dimensions in there, and you just don't want hundreds and hundreds of dimensions showing up. So you want to limit that experience. So here's what I'm going to do. You can pick up a, a, a minimum. What I generally do is the minimum is if you have step sizes, go ahead and start with that step size. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start with five. A maximum, I'm going to punch in 50. And it's going to be increments of five. So let's do that. And go ahead and click OK. What you're going to want to do is click on your parameter again. Right click. Go show parameter. This isn't going to work right now. It's not going to work. Here's the next step. Go to your dimension and right click on it. Go to filter. You want to come up here. You have choices of general, wild card, conditioner, top. You're going to want to click top. You're going to want to come by field. You have a choice here, top or bottom. We'll get to the bottom in a minute. We'll stay with top. So at this point, if you just want to filter and have a static chart right here, you can dial in whatever you want to see. But what we're going to want to do is right click, go down to top in, and click OK. Now you're going to see the top five. Now this is in slider mode right now. You can pick type in. I'm going to keep it in slider mode. And it's going to go in increments of 5. So 10, 15, 20, and so forth. So that is your top end parameter. Let's, let's learn about the bottom end. Very easy. We simply want to go ahead and duplicate this sheet. Let's go ahead and rename it right now. Okay, so we are also going to want to duplicate the top end parameter. Go back. Let's edit this parameter. Let's rename it bottom in. And that's all you have to do to this. Press OK. There it is. Now, this top end. We, we're not going to want to use that, so we're going to go ahead and hide that. Let's go ahead on your bottom end, show parameter. Is it going to work? It, no, it's not. Not right now. We have to come over here to the filter and change it. So let's edit filter. You click on the top. It should be there by now. 
by field, remember this, top or bottom, that's when you're going to want to change it to bottom. And you simply change this to bottom in and watch what happens. And there you go. Now it will show up as the bottom ones. Let me clean this up just a little bit. I want to do entire view. And something else I like to do personally with these packed bubbles is I like to sort descending by field. It automatically has the dimension there. And the reason why I like that is it's more symmetrical. So it keeps the larger ones in the center. And there you have it. You have a bottom in and a top in. And if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you're interested in being notified of more upcoming videos, go ahead and subscribe. And once again, enjoy the rest of your day and thank you for tuning in to the Tableau Jedi channel.